Hi there, welcome back. We're going to do episode number 20. It's called Hashtag Cloud9 Fail. Oh, no. What have they done to get this trending? Oh my god, I dread to think. Oh, oh, I've just seen the title to the next episode. Sandra's Fight. Oh god, I might have to watch that now. I might have to do a reaction to that. I was going to make this one the last one tonight, but I don't know. Oh god, that's going to be um, Sandra and Carol, right? Anyway, look, this one's 20 and it's hashtag cloud nine fail. Let's get to it. No one's covering housewares. I mean, if somebody finds a way to shoplift a couch, then they deserve mm. it. Do see someone taking a couch? Walkie 035. See something? Say something. <laughs> it's not the new said. Corporate is asking us to cut hours again. Oh, oh God. Yes. It already looks like the day after the fire festival in here. I said the exact same thing yesterday. Oh, did you really? Because I wasn't in grocery at the time, so I couldn't have heard you. Oh, is he stealing his phrases? Somebody tweeted, it's just a bunch of beef in a shopping cart. Less meat, more filling? What does that even mean? It's a pun. <laughs> Remember that commercial? Tastes great, less filling? No, I think it was ours. <laughs> oh, <God>. oh. <laughs> Can somebody please take care of that? Okay, Dibs. so that, that's how this hashtag starts. <laughs> oh, he's homeless, isn't he? He probably wants it for... Food? Oh, Marcus. Put it in the fridge at least. I swear, it's like every time we solve one problem, another one pops up. I feel like I'm playing whack-a-mole. <laughs> it can't still be a game, can it? Poor guy. He had kids. <laughs> he had kids? <laughs> yeah. They've been playing soccer over in Toys and Games for the last three months. <laughs> I love their little conversations like that. I saw this methadone study that pays pretty well, but they said I'd have to get addicted to heroin first. <laughs> so that's another expense. <laughs> Garage sale or something. I don't have anything to sell. You have like 83 pairs of sneakers. No one will even hire you if you're on call here all the time. That's why I didn't get that job as a shirtless greeter at Abercrombie and Fitch. No, oh, I used to have that job, but in a guy's house. I knew him. He was my wrestling coach. Something bothering you? If there is, you can talk to me about it. Oh, because she saw Sandra. Well, Sandra's a whore who's my boyfriend. Okay. You no. want to talk, Carol? doesn't know that I know, but that's the way I like it. You can really hurt someone when they don't see it coming. We have a real father-daughter relationship. Thank you, Daddy. That was fucking awesome. creepy. No, no. Do the daddy voice. No, You're Carol. Welcome. Ben's married. Not that'll stop. Well, I thought about doing a webcam, but then Bo said no. And it's like, why does he get to do one and I don't? What, bows on only vans or something? Shopping cart of steaks in your store? Uh-huh. It's a big warning sign for yeah. us. Yeah, you, what? Look, are you having trouble handling things over there? No, no. Well, yeah, stop cutting the hours. You're offering to give me more hours? I, uh... That doesn't seem I likely. Didn't, I didn't realize that was an option. I mean... Um, maybe, yeah, I, we <laughs> could... Or not, I mean, yes. Dude, seriously? How long have you been saving those up for? One embarrassing photo comes out and they're like, here you go. We should start encouraging customers to keep tweeting bad things about us. Yeah, we, why stop there? I mean, we should just create a oh bunch no. of fake Twitter accounts and tweet it ourselves. Ah, uh, we should totally oh no. do that. <laughs> we totally should. No, we should actually do that. Yeah, I, I thought I was communicating that with my eyes. But yeah, yeah, same page. Oh, Amy, you're going to lose this job if you're not careful. How many hours do they have to give? Okay, and <laughs> what should it say? Steelers fan is the one who tweeted about how gross the bathrooms were. My shade's a little more spiritual, more in touch with vibrations. I just put way too much thought into this. Someone left half a cat in electronics. Half a dead cat? Well, no. That's perfect. I can't believe this just fell into our lap. Oh. What? It's the butt half. What the fuck? I got one guy to buy an old bra of mine just by saying it touched my boobs. Wow. <laughs> it's all in the marketing, huh? I think that'll work for you, Glenn. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> There's a hashtag waiting to be done. I have rats soon enough. Already got a raccoon. More people are posting photos of the store. This is why we shouldn't let customers into the store. <laughs> Good plan, Tina. Like, what the hell? I'm up to here with this crap, you know? Like, f these people. <laughs> right. Daisy, oh! go overboard. <gasps> that is how people act when they're upset. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Petit Roche 22 is going to rip our asses for this one. Rip our asses. The Dentifix 100. It looks used. 
That's Who would so sell gross. a used toothbrush? We wouldn't sell that. This is the newest trend in oral hygiene. Do you want a brush that's pre-distressed, like a nice pair of jeans? A friend of mine got one of the old models with the straight white bristles. As if he's thinking about this. Come on. Shreds. She had to get new ones from a dead body. <laughs> what? You have 83 pairs of shoes and none of them light up? Light up? Jesus, Glenn. 50-year-old toddler. Those are original Reebok pumps. When you buy a painting, do you ask how the arch support is? Mm. I'm just looking for something I can go hiking in. Please leave. <laughs> He's not going to be able to let go of any of these, is he, Garrett? He's going to want a connoisseur, sneaker connoisseur. We just keep coming up short. I'm really we worried. We really need to take care of this. I mm. agree, but I am just all out of ideas. If, if you want to suggest anything. Actually, we think all of the tweets have come from an employee at your store. Huh? No, no. If I peed their asses. <laughs> Oh shit! Someone's gonna have to take Hi, the fool here. Luan. I'm from Human Resources. No, no. I'm here because an employee has been tweeting defamatory photos. Did they tell Dina? I don't think they did. And I'm here to find out who it is and to hold them responsible. Nothing will happen to you. Well, we will have to fire them. I know, but don't say it. We almost had them. No, we didn't. Dina, In you're the future, such. If you could just follow my lead, please. Thank you. Excuse me. Oh, Dina. How do you know it's one of us? Well, well, we well, with... came from the same Mac address and that device was logged into the employee Wi-Fi network. Who would be dumb <laughs> enough to send incriminating tweets from the employee Wi-Fi? Well, it <laughs> wasn't me because my phone is on airplane mode and I do not know how to get it off. <laughs> oh, <Glenn. laughs> All the fake customer accounts were created on the same day Good and they China. each only tweeted once. <laughs> What oh a dumbass. <laughs> All right, well, I don't know how productive it is to dwell on how stupid this person may or may not be. <laughs> I think the point is, whoever did it... They should have conferred with Garrett off. first. You have been To watched. be sure it wouldn't be traced. Okay. Yeah. I'm not leaving until we figure this out. Oh, mm -hmm. good. I'm All surprised right. she hasn't said Everyone, handing your phone. Everyone, you're going to have to hand over your phones. Yeah, oh. Dina. No, Dina said it for her. No, right. Luann! Are you serious right now? They probably could, right? Because given what's happened. Oh, dude. Dude, really? Mate. That's why women live longer. <laughs> For starters, neither of us can admit to sending the tweets. Oh, Obviously. Well, that, that's good. Hold on. <laughs> exactly. down. Don't admit to crying. Look. <laughs> If for whatever reason it gets traced back to me, I'm going to say that I acted alone. There's no reason that oh. we should lose our jobs. It's just oh, going to go, okay. okay. <laughs> that, was, that was just kind of like a, a big gesture. Yeah. And she, she accepted. Yeah. No, yeah. No. Yes, of course. No, thank you. Mm -hmm. But I just, I, I kind of figured that's what we would do. Right. Our name is Salary. She can support both of them. So. Yeah. Let's just, let's just move on. I just want to make sure that you're not planning on doing any hiking or grape stomping or anything. You think I'd go hiking in a pair of shoes I've been trying to find for like six years? No, oh, this might be your man. He's going to say something though, isn't he, that's going to put him off selling them. Or is he just not going to be able to? Do today? Because I could give them to you next week. And yeah, he doesn't, just doesn't want to let go. Make them nice. No, that's cool. These are pristine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they are. <laughs> they are pristine. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm going to give you the shoes and they will be yours and not mine. That mm -hmm. is generally how this works. <laughs> Three million dollars. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the first tweet was sent at 10.46.32. Can we see if anyone was on their phone then? Got it. Wait. Okay. Dina, like why? Brent was on his phone. Why does she oh, take the yeah. side of the bosses? Elias isn't on his phone, though I think he might be a... He's having a nap. <laughs> May I? None of this is from today. We used to have cameras in the break room, but then people found out and got all rightsy about oh, it. Oh, this is a recording. Wait. Wait, hold on, what was that? <gasps> oh no! Oh my god! Oh, Garrett. You have to leave the country. Luann, if you'll excuse me. Oh shit! I have some business to take care of. <laughs> you might have to have some cleanup to take care of in a minute. Where is he? But anyway, is any of it valuable? A Neil Diamond cassette tape. <gasps> oh, I'll keep that. <laughs> I've been meaning to check him out. All cards, Mickey Mantle. This is from the first year he ever played, like before he was even famous. Oh, that'd so. be super. That was worth a shot. Oh, go ahead. I had IT look up the websites that were visited by the same device that posted the tweets. Oh. Oh, are they all Greenpeace websites? Huffington Post, Slate, the New Yorker caption contest. <laughs> that rules Marcus out. That really could describe just about everyone who works here. Oh, it's, yeah. a, it's a hip group. Excuse me. 
Oh, hi. Hi. I know who the person is who was tweeting. Oh, is she going to lie and say it was Sandra? Oh, this bitch. Excuse me. She's going to fucking... It? Her name is Sandra Kaluio Kalani. Oh, you can't let her take the rap, guys. K-A-L... Kaluuya. Hey. <laughs> Kaluuya Kalani. Okay. Oh, my God. He told me we're really good friends, so... Well, everyone knows you're not Carol, so... Didn't realize you two were so close. Yeah. Oh, God, maybe I shouldn't have said anything. I'm a horrible person, aren't I? No, you're not. Yeah, you really are. I can't believe Sandra would do something like that. I didn't think she had it in her. I borrowed her car like three years ago and she still hasn't asked for it back. What the fuck? Is that why she's been taking the bus? Cloud Nine's been dicking her over for years. It's true. She got injured on a job when she first started working, and instead of paying her medical bills, they just gave her a blue polo. I guess she just snapped. <laughs> A rebel. She's like a total badass bitch. Mm -hmm. oh my God, is Sandra an icon now? She's like a total <laughs> badass bitch. Heard it both times. Thanks. <laughs> yeah. Sandra does live really far away. Maybe oh, Amy, really come. To, to find a new job closer to home. Okay. He's trying to. He's gonna have to take the hit. Yeah. No, I'm not gonna let you do that alone. It doesn't make sense for both of us to go down. You were counting on me saying that, right? It's just that I make so much more. Oh, money. yeah, you, you mentioned that. Yeah, it's true. Like, you can support him while it's for another job. Remember how we used to have those security cameras in the break room? Well, we came across the time you let all my birds escape. Remember, I was blaming myself for it, and then when I was at my Make lowest, you had attack. sex with me, knowing that hours before, you were the one that let them out. What? And you knew the entire time. And yet you said nothing. Remember that? When you think about it, this whole thing is just funny. Hey, come with me. I want to show you something. No, don't. Garrett, do not follow her. Do not follow her. They went up so fast. It's like they wanted to this, burn. It's sneakers. <laughs> is that air escaping from the sneakers? <laughs> it almost sounds like they're screaming. <laughs> Look at his face. Oh my god. I will never forgive you. <laughs> I don't think Garrett's going to forgive you either, to be honest. <laughs> I did not see that coming. That was hilarious. Garrett's a broken man. Oh, she's found that card. She knows it's worth. <laughs> Even I've heard of Mickey Mantle, right? I think. I don't know what happened. Luann said I was the one who was tweeting, but I swear to God, God. it wasn't me. I never even joined Twitter because I was thinking of running for city council and you know how my humor can get a little edgy. <laughs> yeah. Oh, she's going to lose her icon status. She just going to say she'll... Ah. What is wrong with you people? I didn't do it. It's true. It, it wasn't her. Yeah, of course it wasn't you. Oh, they're going to talk her into accepting it. Superstar. Oh, Sandra, no. She's a badass bitch. Justine, <laughs> just go home. I have every right to be Your here. job's more important Guys, than this. <laughs> you know how corporate just kept cutting back our hours and cutting back our hours. Yeah, yeah. 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 I know they have. Yeah. yeah. Well, well, sometimes I knew it. you just got to say enough. <laughs> oh, God, Sandra. Yeah. No. Yep. This isn't fair. Yeah, right. This isn't right. Yeah. Are they just going to let this happen? <laughs> what, what, what are you going to do? Sandra's found her 15 we're minutes. Stand up. <laughs> we're going to stay strong. Unionize. Oh, yeah. no. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, my God. That was fucking hilarious. That was absolutely hilarious. Oh my god. That was brilliant. That Dina and Garrett th that was hilarious. And that at the end as well. They might have been the two funniest moments of the show for me. That was so funny. Oh goodness. Okay, well I saw that coming. I mean, I, we probably all did right. That's how Sandra is. Oh. What's happening now though? Are they all going to walk out in protest or something? She said they're going to unionize, so... Yeah. She's not going to leave the show. She's definitely not going to leave the show. She's too good. So yeah, there's going to be yeah, there's going to be some chaos in the next episode. What was it called again? Oh, it was. I, I saw the title. It's called Sandra's Fight. I think. Oh, I want to watch that now. Can I do it? I might do it. I might do it. I'll just get up. I need to stretch my legs a little bit. I might do it. I don't know yet. I'm really excited to find out what happens, but. That was really, really good. Really great. I don't know how I feel about Mateo and Amy, though, now, because, all right, they were going to do the right thing, but they must know why Sandra did that, because that's the way Sandra is. She'd take temporary 
fame, let's call it, or, you know, temporary idolization over her full time job. Of course she would, but it's not going to be good for her, is it? Come on, guys. It's almost like Sandra's a little bit kind of a little bit challenged. <laughs> That's why I'm thinking they needed to step in there even so, because they should have realized that and they know her. They, oh, I don't know how I feel about them. They were going to do the right thing. I was, I was happy about that. And at first they weren't, I was worried. And then they were, and I was happy. And I don't think they can just let this, I, Jonah's going to have to take the rap. He is, isn't he? Unless, well, unless Sandra rallies everyone into, you know, getting them to back down, but I can't see that happening. I just can't see that happening. And let's be honest, these hashtags could have been created. Like if there were enough Karens, they could have been created, right? Given the way this store is. I mean, we've seen the fucking mess every episode. Two great scenes there, but I think my favorite one was the burning of the sneakers. That was just so funny. Oh my God. Do you know, I temporarily forgot as well. My me memory's like a goldfish. I forgot I when Dina found out. I should have saw that coming, actually, that they'd have that recorded. Of course, that's the obvious way for her to find out. Because I was thinking, why haven't they found it? Like, I was thinking when it happened, when the bird, when that episode, when he let the birds out, I was thinking, that's definitely going to come back. Definitely. There's no question. And it's been a few episodes now. So, yeah, I think it was in the back of my mind that, is that going to come out or not? They're just going to leave it there? Didn't seem likely. And I should have realised that's obvious, of course, because they've already shown that they they had been surveilling with audio as well right well not that she needed it she saw it on the video right of course and that's that's how she was going to find out of course i should have realized it was that in this no it wasn't the same episode was it yeah it was an, an, an episode later i think when they were doing the whole um security cam thing so i guess that that's probably why they did that episode that was a great episode actually in it by itself but that's probably why they put that in so that they could then come back to it yeah it's clever that was good of course of course but yeah i temporarily forgot my memory is like a goldfish sometimes and it went to another scene it went back and they were together and i just didn't think and then i heard her say you know about yeah the birds and then it oh oh my god they had to you know really m let us know that you know they're like his babies he can't let go of them he can't sell them for any price well three million dollars we knew that about him anyway i mean it was obviously revealed in this episode but it still had the same impact, still had the same effect, right? It definitely still had the same impact, definitely. Oh my God. Because there are people like that who just love sneak... That's another word, by the way, I keep pausing with because we call them trainers. You might have heard me say that before. In fact, if I've said that before and I know how I have recently, was that in reference to something that... I know that was when Glenn was wearing them. Glenn was wearing... I was going to say, was that something Garrett had said? But no, when Glenn was wearing them, the sneakers. We call them trainers. So again, it doesn't matter probably, but... I just want to make sure people understand me. So yeah, um, sneakers. Okay. Yeah, really great, really great one. And yeah, definitely two of my favorite scenes in this one. As an overall episode, it was really good as well. It was really, really good. But was it one of the very best ones in terms of the overall episode? Probably not, probably not. But some great scenes. And yeah, we're going to find out whether I'm going to do it tonight or not. I'm not sure yet. I'm not sure. I'll decide in a minute. But we're going to find out what happens with... Sandra because it's called Sandra's fight the next episode so I did see that in the intro well not in the intro so yeah been in the intro before I started the reaction so yeah um we're gonna find out what happens it's still I was thinking when I saw that I thought I was obviously going to be with Carol and it still might be because Carol's done this to her hasn't she and if, if Sandra finds out although I don't know now she's quite enjoying the fame isn't she she's quite enjoying it so yeah we'll see but it still might be a fight between those two but who knows I guess Sandra felt like she needed backup to be able to fight it right but she didn't tell them it wasn't me after like she said well yeah it was me and i'm gonna fight this you know that's how she but did she actually say that i don't know but that's the impression i got at least if she didn't say that but without that backup without them really supporting her there she was just gonna take it wasn't she like she's so passive well she's really aggressive actually sometimes but she's also really easily led and manipulated and passive as well at the same time it's kind of weird but sometimes she just snaps and I guess if you're that passive, if you let people walk over you that much, eventually you will just snap in certain occasions. So I guess that's what we're seeing with her sometimes. I think a natural personality is to kind of, yeah, let people do what they want with her kind of thing, be super passive. Yeah, and just let people walk over her. But, you know, it's going to get to anyone, isn't it? No matter if it's your personality or not, it's going to get to you eventually. In certain moments, you are going to snap. Yeah. Okay. Well, anyway, really great one. And hopefully you'll join me for episode 21 which I may do in a minute. I don't know yet, but we'll see. So thanks and I'll see you for that one. See ya. Bye.